Happy Thanksgiving from Choose Happiness. So, of course, we're going to talk about gratitude today, as we often do, because practicing gratitude is such a wonderful step in our Choose Happiness journey. When we choose to focus on the positive and then take the time to be grateful for it, it can create such a fundamental optimistic shift in our thinking. When we have the good at the front of our minds and acknowledge it, or when we choose to acknowledge what's not wrong, if that makes sense, that really is an important step in our happiness journey. And yesterday, when I was out for a walk, I passed a woman and she said to me, beautiful day, isn't it? And I said, yes, I'm so grateful. And she stopped and she said, grateful. Yes, grateful. And that was such a cool moment that really illustrates this point of taking a moment to be grateful for something as simple as the weather and acknowledging what a beautiful day it was and then taking the second to be grateful for it. And I was like, I love when this happens. That totally illustrates what I'm about to be talking about. <laughs> And so with Thanksgiving coming, I have seen so many things posted about um, creating a practice like a gratitude journal or creating a gratitude tree or saying our gratefuls, things we're grateful for, um, like five things we're grateful for when we first wake up in the morning or while we're brushing our teeth. That's a really great time when we're alone and not really thinking about anything necessarily um, or saying the gratefuls before we go to bed at night or my personal favorite practice of when we first wake up in the morning asking ourselves, what am I looking forward to being grateful about today? That is really a game changer. And thank you, Dr. Brian Emerson, for that excellent, excellent tip. So those are all fantastic. But I thought today we could do something together in real time. Now this comes courtesy of Mr. Rogers, the beloved Mr. Rogers. And he gave a commencement speech and I'd like to share with you what he said. He said, I'd like to give you all an invisible gift, a gift of silence to think about those who nourish you at the deepest part of your being. Anyone who has ever loved you and wanted what was best for you in life. Some of those people may be right here today. Some may be far away. Some may even be in heaven. But if they've encouraged you to come closer to what you know to be essential about life, I'd like you to have a silent minute to think of them. One minute, I'll watch the time. And I'm gonna add here myself, as you're thinking of them, send out just a silent thank you to them from your heart to theirs. Just a little silent thank you and acknowledgement of how grateful you are for how they've helped you get to this point in your life. It could be friends, family members, teachers, neighbors, um, doctors, firefighters, maybe a good Samaritan whose name you don't even know. But let's just take a silent minute together to think about those people and then say thank you to them. So I will watch the time. Ready? Go.
I'd also like to say a huge, grateful, filled thank you to all of you for supporting Choose Happiness for all of this time and for all of your encouragement. And P.S. Uh, Choose Happiness 2, the book, will be coming out shortly, so stay tuned. And I just want to wish you all a safe, happy, and healthy Thanksgiving. And I'm so, so grateful to you. Be well. Thank you. Mwah.